I don't know what happened, you all. I think I lost connection. Um, I don't know what happened, but let's try to get the followers back up, you all. Let's get the followers back up. Come on, please join. Please join. Please join. Invite followers over. All of those that um, that uh, got disconnected like I did, or I don't know what happened uh, with this Periscope thing, but uh, okay. Frozen, thanks for coming back. Thanks for coming back, you all. Um, as always, invite your followers. Give me some hearts. Give me some love. Again, I want to kind of build up the uh, the amount of people that join in here before I get started because I want to make sure it's a, uh, we have a good solid number so I don't have to uh, g you know, go over this over and over again. Happy Saturday to you. Happy Saturday. It's such a beautiful day here in Chicago. It's a little chilly, but the sun is shining, and I'm happy about that. So, um, join in, join in, invite your followers, invite your followers. So, uh, many many people, uh, and I'll just kind of go over this one more time, many people have been asking uh, about... Uh, whether or not I'm going to be coming out with a book. So many people uh, have been looking for the recipes and looking for the many things that I've uh, been able to do as it relates to uh, my weight loss journeys, how I was able to lose weight, uh, how I've been able to keep it off and maintain a healthier lifestyle. Uh, so the wait is over. And I'm introducing uh, my book and the working title, as you all know, the working title uh, is The Spice Diet. And I'm excited about the title. Um, you know, I've never been a, a huge proponent of the word diet, but in this book, I redefine what diet is. So I give diet a whole new definition, tw uh, 2016, 2017 and beyond uh, definition of what the word diet is. Um and for me, it's about healing people. It's about a lifestyle change. It's about achieving weight loss goals. Uh, but it's making sure that we are healthy and that we are living long lives for the rest of our lives. So in this book, uh, you're going to really understand. And Tanais, good to see you. Oh my gosh. She is giving, um, I'm giving her a shout out. She's out in uh, France. In Paris. I don't know if you're still in Paris, Tennis. Let me know. That's my girl. When I was over in, uh, in Paris, um, studying, uh, food, she actually helped me out, picked me up from the airport. That's my girl. So mad love to you, girl. I miss you so much. Um, so the book is, the book is just a dynamic book. Again, it is, designed to get people to fall back in love with healthy food, uh, using spices and using flavor and using ingredients. So what I'm doing is I'm teaching people how to pair the right spices and the right ingredients, I'm making it super simple, very easy, uh, but most importantly, something pleasing to the palate. For so long, I find that a lot of people get on these healthy uh, lifestyle journeys, you know, and, you know, they're making their meals and I'm looking at their like weekly meals and, you know, it's the same exact thing, you know, uh, boiled chicken or broccoli or uh, salmon, you know, and it's always done like one or two ways. So a lot of people ask me, you know, I'm just sick of the uh, the mundane way that I make salmon or the way that I make chicken. And, you know, it uh, it encourages me to go out to the fast food restaurants and order food. So I find myself, um, you know, trying to do right, trying to eat healthy, but because it gets boring, you know, I go back to what I, I'm used to and, and what's good to me. So, uh, you know, I dispel that and I take the guesswork out of it and I teach you how to uh, build these spices and build these flavors. And I introduce uh, the medicinal benefits of the spices in a way that we all can understand it and learn. Right. I share with you all my story, how I did it. I get really, really real with the fact that I was addicted to food and how food almost took me out of this world, you know, really took me out. But uh, by influencing uh, food with the different spices and recreating and and and, and uh, redeveloping a new way of cooking, 
you all, I, I mean, it saved my life. It really did save my life. I was able to achieve weight loss. I've been able to achieve a healthy lifestyle, maintain a healthy lifestyle through the process. So uh, you'll get a lot of this in this book. I'm telling you, this book is going to be a healer. I'm telling you, it is going to heal so many lives, so many people, uh, not only in the States, but around the world. One thing that I found uh, very interesting is some of the uh, some of the countries in the uh, Arab, Arab Arabic countries um, are are struggling with weight uh, or excuse me have higher obesity levels than some uh, some places in the U.S. or in America, right? So, I mean, weight issues, obesity, uh, addiction to food. It's something that not only affects us in America, but just affects people around the world. Um, either our, you know, either we as individuals suffer from it or we know people that are suffering from it. Uh, you know, and along with that comes. Uh, the diseases and the diabetes and the high blood pressure and things like that. So we want to cut that stuff out. You know, we want to live longer. We want to live healthier. We want to live better lives. Um, you know, prosperous lives because we all have a purpose and a plan. So, you know, I help you define what that is and, and, uh, and help you to, uh, make sure that you're able to maintain that healthy lifestyle so that we all can carry out our purpose and our plans and our, and uh, what God has for us for our lives. So. I'm excited about it. Uh, the book will also, uh, I'm going to create a, a webinar or a webinar is being created right now that will be loosely based off of the book as well. Uh, so it will be a multi-series webinar. Um, and what we'll do is we will be introducing the different concepts to the book, getting you excited, getting you motivated. Um, and also, uh, just kind of helping you along the way before the book actually launches, um, which will be at the end of 2016, beginning of 2017, uh, Pennsylvania in the house, shout out to Pennsylvania. Wow. I love it. So, um, get excited about this stuff. You know, I mean, this is, you know, I know a lot of people just are always asking questions about, uh, you know, what they can do to lose weight. So many people, uh, are, are interested in losing weight. So many people are just interested in being healthy, right? So this is going to be, uh, this is going to be the missing link, uh, that a lot of people are looking for. You know, a lot of people want to get back in the kitchen. Cooking is fun, right? Um, cooking is exciting. And, you know, Think if you think about it, uh, food photography, food photos, uh, those are some of the highest um, searched applications on the internet, on Google, right, on social media, um, all of those. So people are taking photos of their food. They're capturing images of what they're eating, right? So people are in love with food. We just have to be in love with the right type of food, right? So. That's what this is going to be all about. I'm going to be, I mean, I'm, I'm just so excited. You know, the words are not coming like I really want them to come out, but, uh, because I'm just so excited about it. And it's, I don't want to give away too much. So I'm, um, you know, I wanted to, I wanted to come out at certain levels, you know, uh, introduce you all at certain points, um, about the book. I don't want to give it all away, you know. I'm known for that. You know, I get so doggone excited and I just let it all out. And uh, I don't want to do that. So uh, I definitely want to take you out through this journey and through this process uh, with me. Uh, speaking that this book will be an international bestseller. Uh, I believe it. I've already seen it. And how many of you all know that when you are able to visualize and see something, then you know it's a reality. So I see it. I see it just being huge. I hate cooking, but I love eating. Yeah, well, you know what? The This book will hopefully inspire you to, to fall in love with cooking. Fall in love with cooking. Food and cooking, does, I mean, cooking does not have to be intimidating at all. And I take away the intimidation, right? And what I do is I bring in that element of making food fun, right? So we're bringing our friends and our family into the kitchen, you know, sometimes we don't like to cook just because sometimes we don't either know how or we're not motivated to 
Or sometimes our food just don't turn out right. You know what I mean? Or people are like, yeah, she can't cook, you know. But when you find that uh, you're good at something, when you find that you're developing something, then you continuously build and hone that love for something, right? So especially if it has to do with your health, right? So uh, I'm encouraging you. I'm challenging you all. For those that don't like to cook, uh, I'm c- confident that this book is going to help you fall in love with cooking. And for those that love to cook, uh, but find yourselves not knowing the right, you know, the right thing and the right way to cook and make things a little healthier, this is going to make you fall back in love with healthy food. Okay. Crock pot fanatic. Oh my gosh. We're going to be doing some crock pot, one pot wonders. Uh, we're bringing in a lot of mashups. And when I call them mashups, I'm talking cultural fusion, right? So these recipes are going to blow your mind. These are not no bland, uh, crappy, uh, recipes. I, I was going to say something else. I was going to put some, some things on blast, but these recipes are not your mundane, crappy, just, you know, ucky recipes. These recipes, uh, and food dishes are things that y'all are going to enjoy, right? So things like a roasted, um, one of my favorites in the cookbook is, or the, the book, because it will both talk about my story. It'll give you tips, uh, and it will give you a plan and it will also give you recipes and it will also introduce you to the spices and the ingredients, right? So, uh, it's beyond just a cookbook. Um, but one of my favorite recipes in the book is my roasted fig infused hummus and it is off the chain, y'all, off the chain. And I serve it with crispy pita. Oh my gosh, it is so amazing. And I know some of y'all are like figs and hummus. Y'all don't knock it till you try it. The figs are roasted, slow roasted in the oven with a little bit of honey. And then you're blending that with, uh, with chickpeas and other really, really nice savory ingredients. So you get this sweet and savory element. And then you pair that with these kind of like uh, crispy, um, crispy pita chips. And I do a little Cajun seasoning over them. So you get sweet, savory, and spicy, y'all. Oh my gosh. I'm talking heaven. I'm talking this stuff is off the chart. Good. Um, so, you know, these are the things that you're going to get. It's, it's not going to be your same old, same old recipes. These recipes are going to be interesting. They're going to be creative, but most importantly, they're going, they're going to be very easy and simple. Uh, we will have recipes in there that are a little bit more advanced for those that know how to kind of rock and roll in the kitchen. So you'll see different phases in there of, uh, complexity with recipes as well. So for all of you all that are like home cooks and, and, and chefs, it's going to be something there for you, for you all that are novices in the kitchen that are like, I don't know, boiling an egg is a bit of a challenge. I got something for you too. <laughs> Can't wait to get the book. So I encourage you all continue to follow me on my website for more information on the webinar uh, and the book, uh, JudsonToddAllen.com, JudsonToddAllen.com. If somebody can go ahead on and drop the uh, link for my website at the bottom of the screen, I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, somebody go ahead and drop the link, judsetideallen.com, my website. You all can go there. Thank you, sweetie, for you to know. Sweetie, for you to know. I love that. Uh, thanks so much for dropping that. Got to give us a demo of the fig and hummus. Yeah. So you're going to see a lot of this in the, in the webinar, right? So in the webinar, we're going to have demos. We're going to have, uh, instructional, uh, material for you. It's just going to be a very, very, um, interactive, thorough, um, webinar series, uh, that is, uh, designed to really teach, motivate, inspire. Uh, but most importantly, I want to make sure that, that, we're making sure that people seek change, you know? So I want this to be uh, something that is helpful and healing to people. So thanks so much for dropping that website, you all. Thank you. Thank you. Um, what else? What else? What else? So, oh, yeah. Follow me on social my social media links. Uh, you can go to my Instagram and my Twitter. 
at Judson Todd Allen. Uh, I'm also on Facebook. Um, so you can go to my Facebook page and I've got a fan page on there as Chef Judson Todd Allen. Uh, I encourage you to please share this with your followers. Um, just let your followers know your fans of fans. Your, yeah, I cannot talk. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Let your um, fans, friends, and family. That's a tongue twister. Let them know who I am. Let them know where they can follow me. Encourage them to go to my website, uh, JudsonTideAllen.com. As always, y'all know y'all can rock with me. Get my hot sauce, y'all. This is my special blend of hot sauce. It's a chef blend hot sauce, all natural, healthy, low sodium. So I use it as a salt substitute, okay? And you can purchase it on my website. It's all natural. You can purchase it at www.jetsontideallen.com. Um, yeah, so thanks so much, y'all. I appreciate for those that are joining me on this Saturday uh, for taking your time just to kind of uh, chill with me on Periscope and learn a little bit more about the Spice Diet and about my book and the webinar. Um, I'm going to be doing these periodically because I just want to continuously get the word out to people. So if you all can spread the word for me, help me spread the word. Okay. Um, we're going to also be doing some giveaways. So get ready for that. Cause we've got some really, really cool, really, really cool giveaways, products, tickets, see Steve Harvey, uh, we got all kinds of stuff. My hot sauce, which is the most valuable gift. <laughs> um, and so many other things that we're going to be doing, uh, just to kind of keep everybody motivated, make it fun, uh, make it entertaining. Uh, but most importantly, we all want to make it purposeful, right? So I hope this has been helpful. If it has, give me some thumbs up. Let me know if this has been, uh, if you all have enjoyed this Periscope, give me some thumbs up. Let me know if you all are excited about the book and the webinar, give me thumbs up. Give me hearts if you all are excited about, um, about the book and the webinar. Give me lots and lots of hearts. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. Awesome. Well, I love you all so much, as always. I love you, love you, love you. Um, and let's continue to stay motivated. Let's continue to stay inspired. Oh, my gosh. I sent you 3,000 hearts. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what? That is dope. You rock. How do you say? Wow. I'm still trying to figure out how people have been sending, like, 3,000 hearts. And that's a lot of hearts. And I'm so grateful. Thank you. Because my goal was to get 3,000 hearts by the end of the week. Excuse me, excuse me. My goal was to get 300,000 hearts by the end of the week. So that totally helped. So if everybody gives me 3,000 hearts, I think I can get there. I think I can get close to it. All right. Tap game is strong. Wow. <laughs> Some of y'all tap, tap, tap. I heard that. Tap, tap, tap. Somebody say tap. <laughs> I tap in my phone will freeze. Oh, okay. So some of you all can do the heart. Some of y'all can't. Now I get it. I get it. All right, y'all. You see, I'm bundled up in my fuchsia scarf. <laughs> I'm going to head on out. I've got some things to do. Uh, of course, I'm going back home, getting back into this book. Um... You know, I'm putting my putting a lot of my life on hold. Uh, I wanted to do some traveling uh, this week and next week. I wanted to get to New York, but uh, I think I'm going to put that on hold because I've got to really, really finish and focus on this book. So uh, maybe I'll get there sooner or later. But I wanted to get there this week and next. And this week is over, so... Um, same color as my hair. I love the scarf. Oh, wow. So your hair is this color. That's dope. Look at you. Fancy. Too cold moving to Florida. Yeah. <laughs> well, if you move to Florida, send me some sunshine and some heat. NYC in the house. Definitely. Man, shout out to NYC. Love New York. All right, y'all. I'm going to jump off. 
Again, love you all so much. Continue to share. Uh, go to my website for recipes. For more information, JudsonTideAllen.com. And I will see y'all uh, maybe a little later. We'll see. All right. Bye-bye.